let's keep it high because the other one is low. The other song that has a death metal chorus. Yeah. This recording is basically an expression of all of them in their prime, in their hunger, in their humility, in everything that we had in Roots, like on the spiritual level, um, plus more. There is no drama, there is no, there's no outside forces like pulling and pushing, it, it's like we're on our own island. Coming out of the pool! Pull, you know, coming out of it into the beat. Be more, be more uh, homeland. That's how a great record is made. You know, you're, you're here together to do something special and create a, a life form. And um, there's no outside interference. You know, that's a band. It's a pirate ship. You know. Ross was kind of away from the, the metal scene, you know. I mean, he did like Slipknot and, you know, Limp Bizkit and many other bands, as, as everybody knows. He worked with The Cure and many other different stuff, you know. So I think we felt, and he felt as well, Ross Robbins, that it would be a good time for us to, to do something again together, you know. To be able to stay in the same place. You know, we've done that before a few times. And uh, on the past records we, we recorded here in Sao Paulo, which which is good, but it's, you have to set your, your mind in a different level because you have to deal with a lot of traffic, you know, coming out of you know, different types of stresses or whatever. And there you just didn't even you wake, wake up, go to the kitchen, prepare breakfast, and wait for everybody to get up and be ready to play. Not a, a, a right time to start or to finish. Everything depended on, on the vibe, and I think it was it was very important to 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 be there at the moment. And it made a lot of difference. Well, I was excited about being in Venice, being in the state recording. It's been a long time since we'd done a recording in the U.S. It was really interesting to to meet Ross. I heard so much about him. I, familiar with a lot of work that he had done before. I think the, the, the Derek is, a, is, is, is his best work for sure. And there's a lot to do with Ross Robinson. Stop the guy! No foes! <laughs> it's like, you know, intense, you know, so there. You can feel that as well, you know. It doesn't have necessarily to be metal, you know. It's just the way we, we choose to express. And he understands very well. Vocally, I wanted to achieve uh, being able to have different ranges and different levels and, and different emotions where you can really feel uh, in the music, you know, it's almost like a, an acting almost, you know, really envisioning everything as, uh, as it's singing it, you know, and just putting that, uh, that purity there, that, uh, that openness on it was something that I really wanted to express and, you know, and I, I was hoping, you know, I'm hoping that people will be able to hear that, you know, that, that power and that that openness, you know, just really giving the music. Open. 